It's 91X. Hillary here, live at Rexa Halls with AFI. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. I wasn't for expecting that. No, it makes me <laughs> yeah, feel strange about being supine. <laughs> <laughs> but these couches are so cool. I know. It's, it's, it's really... It, it's an inclination to go back because there is an Literally incline. Literally an incline. <laughs> an incline. Yeah, they are rather inviting. Yeah. Uh, so you guys, yeah. first of all, thank you from the bottom of our collective hearts for being here tonight. Oh, yeah. yeah You're we're really to. doing us a solid. And beyond that, you guys are so awesome that it's it's a huge deal for us thank that you. you guys are here. Thank, thank you. Hillary. Yeah, we were really... Uh, flattered to be asked and you know as I would mentioned I was going to be down here anyway and Adam doesn't have to be back to San Francisco yeah. for a couple hours so if, if I remember correctly 91X was the first station to start playing Days of the Phoenix that's true way back in uh, 2009 2009 um, <laughs> and we have never forgotten that so we are happy to uh, fill in and, and do that solid yeah thank you for it, it is huge and we appreciate that and yeah we have always loved Long time you guys and yeah absolutely but it's it is a really big deal i mean it really was was it thursday like yes th- th- you this all came down on thursday yeah got this, the call this all came down on thursday and it, that's right because at midnight on thursday night friday morning i was fast asleep and my phone started buzzing and it was halloran and all it said was they're in whoa and, I was oh. like, and we're there <laughs> Wow. Oh, yeah. Really, truly, it's, I mean, it's an honor to be asked that, that you would uh, perceive us as being a, a, yeah. a nice surprise. It's very humble, Davey. Because <laughs> most people do don't perceive anything I'm a part of yeah. as being a nice surprise. Next time, just send the beacon out, you know, the 91X <laughs> beacon. And we'll, okay. You know, we don't even have to get on the phone. We'll just show up. You will answer the call. Oh, the call. Yeah. I love that. I thought you meant on stage instead of us. And I was like, what is this? No, like the beacon into the sky. Oh, right, right, right. When we answer the call, like the bat, like the bat, the bat call. Um, you guys played last night? We did. Did you? How'd it go? It was fantastic. Good. It was really fun. Yeah. Awesome. It was our first show um, in two years, mm-hmm. I think. Yeah, no about way. that. Yeah. Was it really? <laughs> yeah, since burials. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. And so it was good? No, like technically did everything no. go well? <laughs> no? No, it didn't. And that is a good question because... <laughs> As typical with AFI, there were technical difficulties. So, like, what do you do? Like, st- is it happening as you're on stage? Per- in playing? this, I'm not going to like over your hand. In this, I as I just stipulate, I will continue to hold on My your hand. New BFF. Um, in this instance, we were very lucky because the technical difficulties we could not hear. Yeah. Oh. That's yeah. It was good. the way there. Were, the audience did, which is unfortunate. Yeah, like, I think everybody then, except for the four of us was aware that there was a huge problem. But that's probably the best scenario. Yeah. Best case of the worst case. It doesn't scenario. throw you Yeah, because it didn't I throw assume. us. We thought everything went great. Okay. It did not. And Apparently, so it started going better around song three. <laughs> okay, that's not too bad. We yeah. played eight. Um, <laughs> we oh, played eight songs total. Right. So. Okay. Yeah, so we, but I mean, did, did, what does math say on that? Three quarters. Right. <laughs> Three quarters of the way. It was okay. Yeah. Uh, did someone inform you then immediately following the set? Like, yeah. Yeah, it sounded pretty awful. Yeah. First couple times. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, that oh. would be our manager's job. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> yeah. That All happened right. to us after Saturday Night Live. Yeah, that what? was. A little it was really devastating <laughs> because, as I mentioned, it is very rare that we perform where there's not technical difficulties. If there's ever a really big show, mm-hmm. um, if there's a TV camera mm-hmm. at all, yeah. it's or a if there's a, a radio broadcast, um, you it's can pretty down. much expect something it's to, going down. to go wrong. Really? But, oh. but we're kind of, you know, we and just roll with it. And, but we and didn't hear it on Saturday Night Live either, so we came off and we were so happy. Yeah. That we, couldn't, we could not believe there were no like technical we difficulties. And, and everyone backstage was silent. Yeah. No. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. We did the whole performance, and the only active mics were the vocal mics. Everything else, all the drums and no. guitar and bass, think, weren't live. Yeah, yeah. Does someone then? Are there repercussions for a sound engineer? Like, no. Well, this it wasn't ours. It was Union, and it was actually it, Lorne Michaels at the at the after party said to me, "Sorry about that. I promise we'll make it up for you. You'll come back." Okay. Not haven't yet. been invited back uh, quite yet. But, but you do have a new album coming out. We do. We do. We do. And Blood is coming out. And, and, and we don't want to sound ungrateful because even, oh, no. even with the botched audio, it no. was a great oh, experience. Sure. I'm, sure, yeah. I'm sure Lauren um, is not offended or listening yeah. or, or knows who this person is that's speaking right now. You're a Davey. Uh, <laughs> Lauren, did you hear what Davey said about bro, you? Bro, Again. Thing, Davey Havoc I love said. him so much. How dare he? <laughs> <laughs> so let's talk about the Blood album then, because Davey, you were here at 91X just a couple weeks ago, uh, hanging out with me on the air, and at that point you said, 
like tentatively it's going to be called the blood album that's what we're calling it yeah but now it looks official right is that what it is i think it, it the the um the statement holds kind of true it's 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 a self-titled release We've been referring to it as, as blood or the or the blood record, okay. uh, due to the themes and there was a reoccurrence of the word blood in the lyrics that I was writing for the record as we were writing them and midway through I recognized that and um, th- brought it up to Jade like hey this word keeps reoccurring it might be something that we might want to recognize later when we you know further the release and really have a clear idea of what we're going to do and at that point it did seem appropriate and thus blood it is okay yeah and jade produced it right jade did produce it yeah that's awesome yeah yeah you said that was fun but felt very natural too so natural yeah Yeah. um i mean for years jade has been demoing the material and you know in the studio there's always layers that are added on and and with these full demos he was doing he was able to do a lot of that arranging and additions like kind of before we even began recording it so there's that's cool um and he you know, just had this oversight that was really natural and uh, really did a great job. Um, yeah, I've, I've only heard like, you know, a song here and a song there and five songs here and one song there. All right, all right. Um, it's no, almost it, all of them. It, it, yeah, I guess so. <laughs> it sounds so good, yeah. though, and it Thanks. kind of reminds me of like a real classic AFI sound, but then... You know, very like modern and new, well, and thanks. like we just started playing White Offerings. I think okay. like on Friday. Oh, really? Like, let's cool. throw it oh, in. Okay, They're cool. coming down. Oh, well, thanks. Yeah, That's totally. cool. That's cool. Um, Thank you. Yeah, it's never really um, for us when when we're writing or we're creating. There's never a pointed direction to that we follow. It's it's not a matter of uh, explicitly discussing wanting to sound one way or another. We just write so much, and generally the material that is new for us uh, is and fresh is what inspires us. Uh, so, you know, when something is, is unique, we tend to head in that direction. And when something feels like something we've done before, we tend to shy away from it. And a large group of songs results, and then we decide what we all feel is the best representation of who we are at that time. And at this time, it's what you heard. It's and blood. I remember you said, like, you guys are prolific songwriters like you had like a huge batch yeah. of songs right yeah that's yeah. typically the case as actually Jade pointed out the other day we wrote around 60 for this record which is not the most that we've written for records I before I mean that. he said that we wrote like what did he say for December Underground like something 100. like 100 yeah yeah. I mean the full band doesn't necessarily work out 100 no, songs no 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 right um, a lot of them like are kind of thrown away before bef- Hunter and I even hear them right right yeah. but are you guys so since last night was your first song and so, or first show in so long? Did you play a bunch of new songs from the new record? We played or? Snowcast and White Offerings. Okay. Yeah, you cool. know, for a set of, of thirty minutes, two might even be too many new yeah, songs. Yeah, it's kind of honest. ambitious. <laughs> yeah, it's oh. ambitious to play two, uh, two um, but they went really well. Good. I mean, the reaction to Snowcast was really palpable and, and really uh-huh. gratifying, um, which I is exciting. It'll be here as well. I hope so. Play in the crowd. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. So great. Thank you. Um, So the album comes out January 20th. Mm -hmm. Is it completely done now? Oh, yeah. It's been it's been done for for, for a while. All right. Yeah. It's ready. It's ready. It's there. Nice. People Um, heard it. So, yeah. Well, um, I've heard it. It's going to feel really good. I like the old shit better, though. (laughs) (laughs) Beep. Um, Oh, sorry. (laughs) Yeah. I did it. I said I wasn't going to do it. It's all right. It's okay. Uh, so what Come then on. after this you New. do you're, you're okay it's okay Sorry, Hillary. Um, are you just touring like crazy then is that the deal yeah we have uh, we have a US tour planned uh, it begins January 20th it goes okay. through February whatever but we'll be here in that's San Diego that's right I wanted to talk about two that two shows oh yes mm-hmm. oh. maybe if there's demand we would add another one I don't know really maybe yeah, because it's, it's you're playing Observatory. I did want to ask you about that, which isn't a huge venue for, for AFI. Like, people are so stoked yeah. to get those tickets. Oh, that's great. They're going to be so close to you. I mean, it's a good size venue, but it's not the sports arena. Here, right. You know? right, 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 right. And, and yeah, I mean, people have been going, like, on Monday, we announced the San Diego dates in February, and people were losing their minds. Oh. And then when we announced that you guys were added to this people were losing their minds oh, that's sold fantastic. even more tickets and i know that tickets for the february shows 
if it's not sold out already, I, I mean, that they were going. I think it was the yeah, first. I, I think they, they, they sold out. Yeah. Yeah. I think okay, two sold out. Thought. Yeah, San Diego has always been so supportive. The fan base here has been great since yeah. since mm-hmm. our earliest shows here when we would play the little side room at Soma. And mm-hmm. did we ever play? Where else did we play? Did we play anywhere pre Soma? Those are my yeah, earliest memories. A, of my work. Did we play a, parties or something? There's kind of a jockey like sports bar that used to have show- Kings. But that was Kings later. Oh, my oh, that was after. That was later. Yeah, yeah that Kings was later. Down Kings. at the beach. Yeah, yeah. 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 Kings was later. I, think I saw you guys at Kings. Sure, actually. it was yeah. like like late '90s and yeah. early 2000s. Yeah. But yeah. the yeah. earlier ones were Soma. Soma. Do you know we're like we're very close to Soma right now? Soma like is right there. That's Jimmy said on the way But so Soma has moved. Oh, it's the new Soma. There's a new Soma. It's actually an old movie theater. We've ever right. played there, or do uh, we play there 4, once? That room. big one. Yeah, we yeah. did it once. Okay, yeah, yeah. No, we've never played. Oh, pff, we played there once, but we used to play. Yeah, the side stage, side and, stage and, and then the, main, the big room. Yeah, but the big room was like twelve hundred or something like right. that. Which is, I yeah. think, around what Observatory is now. So it's awesome, you guys. Oh, okay. Put two nights up for grabs right away, and a third night. Yeah. Please do it, AFI. We would. I'm gonna need it. a place to crash does anyone out there have a place for me to stay if it's gonna be I that many i imagine many there are right. a few fans in town who would be happy to accommodate you and you can get all the all kindred you want if you're in san diego for a few nights <laughs> we're staying at your Halloran house we're you staying up. at Halloran's. he's got a couch if we got it if it's gonna be that many on the beach i'm in i'll you, bring a parasol how much sunscreen do you wear davy like a lot most of it yeah me too most of it I try yeah i get yeah. tan do you yeah even with sunscreen? Yep. Nice. Yep. You put sunscreen, sunscreen, put me in the sun for two minutes, dark. Do you ever carry a parasol? I used to all the time, yeah. Did you really? Yeah, yeah, all the time. They're kind of handy. Like, yeah, I, they, I never did. It helps. You carry it. Just don't get tan. Don't get the sun. Yeah, get a lot of attention, though. Oh, sure. You do. Probably, yeah. You do. Well, listen, do. we're so grateful that you guys are here. Thank you. It's a huge yeah, thank deal you. for us. Thanks for thank you us. so much for being here. Absolutely. AFI, uh, the Blood Album comes out January 20th, live from Rexel Hall's night number two. Yeah. Yeah.